So folks, it is upon us. I was going to try and do a little bit of a skit, seeing as it is T minus 25 and a bit hours until Dragonflight release. Um, a little bit less, depending on where you are in the world, but fairly close. And I wanted to basically release a video, let you guys know what to expect in the coming weeks and months for the channel, for my content things you enjoy from here and kind of follow up from community posts as well so we're going to be dipping and diving around a little bit but hopefully we're going to keep this video relatively short because we need to practice that so first off and swapping to the main screen is we have been tasked with or more accurately we've been awarded as part of the Twitch uh, support streamers event, which means that you're going to be able to earn the Itchapod pet from my channel. We are on the list, which is going to be quite nice. For those of you that don't know, basically from November the 28th, Dragonflight release, through to December the 12th, you're going to be able to watch my stream a couple of subs if uh, if you're feeling up to it or can afford to because let's face it the current climate is naff but doing so will allow you to earn a pet that's unique is form of a drop so first world of warcraft drop which is great and just for the sake of you know proof and i'm not just chatting bullshit for those of you that are just coming to the channel Let's scroll down all the way to O's. As you can see, there's a lot of streamers here. So you don't necessarily just have to watch me. By all means, go support everybody. It's great that they're doing this uh, initiative. But as I say, we are all the way down. We're at the ends now. <laughs> Yay, we're getting there. Uh, uh, there we go. Now we're at OD, OH. O M N P. There we go. We have me here. So you can go through this through the Wowhead post. You can click me and it will bring up my Twitch for those of you that aren't subscribed to me already over on that. What this does mean then going forward, it means that we are going to have to fit in streaming. Now, for those of you that are a little bit new to the channel or haven't been following my journey IRL and my kind of live updates as it were, I'm now working full time. I graduated from my degree and I'm now working a 40 hour job on top of trying to do all my YouTube stuff. So content has been a little bit sporadic. Um, that is going to settle going into Dragonflight and this is following up from the content creation community posts that we discussed. Now, a lot of you are very strongly weighted towards my guides, which means that we're going to change the format from some of the other stuff, which is going to enable us to stream. I'm going to be looking to stream Wednesdays and Thursdays um, because they're going to be my days off from work so we're going to kind of turn them into our stream days if i'm not working at my day job we're going to try and stream and we're going to fit in content creation in more of a stream format so it might look more like you're used to in typical wow fashion which does mean that for those of you that have any knowledge in terms of where i might be able to get some decent music that isn't going to get copyright striked through the youtube videos by all means put the comments in the suggestion below and i will price things up um because we're going to need some background music for those keys that i'm going to be doing live on stream and then converting that into raw footage for you guys because i'm going to spend my dedicated youtube hours in the coming weeks getting the guides out for you that you all love and enjoy which will be broken down into affliction demonology and destruction obviously and depending on how in-depth you guys want me to go again your feedback is greatly appreciated for this kind of thing we're then going to be able to go into potentially a just flat warlock class video itself or i will break it down into the respective class guides and maybe just do dedicated single target versus aoe videos and break the specs up that way depending on how you guys want to consume this content because 
for those of you that have kind of kept up to date with my beta talent tree videos, you already know that there's a lot of variance in some of these specs and how they can be played. So we're going to try and keep the guides as they are and the way you guys enjoy it but everything else is going to shift so like dungeon commentaries and things like that are going to be more from a live perspective which will be the streaming element as we try and weave this pet promotion and the twitch drops into it and that's kind of where that side of things is going to be looking so hopefully you guys are looking forward to it in terms of the actual channel itself and the classes we're going to be covering because that's also going to be quite a big thing as well i have a little bit of an announcement and a little bit of an introduction to make and that would be the fact that i have three warlocks <laughs> so from a rating perspective you guys know that i have now been a warlock for a while and a lot of you have come to my channel for the Warlock content, with my most popular videos by far being my Warlock guides. However, you will see that my Paladin is still there, so for the OG among you, the Paladin will still get content thrown out, but the priority is going to be becoming a God-tier Warlock. Oramis the Orc is going to be obviously our priority and our gearing character, but Uramis and Oralok are both supplementary characters where I'll be running, you know, my professions, doing stuff while still getting in my hours on practice. So, for instance, I might dedicate Oramis himself as the, or herself in her current format, as the main warlock spec, so whichever one, quote-unquote, sims the best, will be that, while the other two off specs, which may be performing a little bit worse, so for example, Demonology, Affliction, Destruction, these two will then practice the off specs, where it doesn't necessarily matter from a Bleeding Edge perspective as the guild pushes into the 500 world rank. Obviously, I'll keep you guys updated on the raid stuff, and we'll probably throw out the raid guides as well, like we have done up until this point. When we get a new kill, I'll, I'll talk about it, and it'll be recorded. So, yeah, this kind of sums up my what to expect, as it were, as we go into Dragonflight. Hopefully, you guys are going to stay with me for the journey, and some more of you will join. Because it's been a wonderful year, and honestly, it's kind of feeling a little bit like Christmas. So, yeah, I hope you all have a wonderful couple of days at the start of Dragonflight. I hope launch is smooth for everyone, and I will probably see you all... Tuesday night going into Wednesday morning when I'm off and I can obviously dedicate the time to streaming and leveling the uh, DOG characters. So in the meantime, hope you all have a wonderful evening and I will catch you all then. Enjoy Dragonfly, folks. Take care.